I always describe it as more of a rock opera in a sense. You know, if you think of shows um, like Rent, Evita, Jesus Christ Superstar, those musicals that are more sung through, there's very little dialogue in the show. So the dialogue that is there is very important. Are you playing? Are you playing? Are you pushing? Are you watching all that shit? Are you losing? Are you broken? Are you feeling? Are you hoping for life to end? And nothing tells you to know that it's all Diana's story is about a mother who uh, is diagnosed with bipolar depression and her journey with um, parenthood, her marriage, and how it works in modern society and how to deal with it. So Diana has a song, I Miss the Mountains, and I mean, that's a lot of the show. You have high highs and low lows in this show, and the audience gets to go along for the ride with all of it. And I, I think, you know, it won a Pulitzer for a reason. Uh, so I play Gabe. He is the son of the family that the story surrounds. And he deals with uh, how he relates to his family, being kind of a rebellious, rebellious teenager, and how he fits in to his family and the world around him. Take a look at the invisible girl. Here she is, clear as the day. Please look closely and find her before she fades away. Yeah, so we have two companies of performers. We have the Red Pill cast and the Blue Pill cast. All of our performers are uh, college-aged through into your early 40s, early 50s. Um, we, we, so we've got a good range of people here, and there are so many unique perspectives in this show um, that being able to work with two companies of varying levels of life experience and of professional credits and you know all of these different nuances that make each performer and individual has been such a gift as a director. My So to have a role like Diana, where a unique, everything is focused on her and she's nuanced and she's not good or bad and she's got a lot to think about, it's opportunity for an actress over 40. I think what's so interesting about this show is that it is a marathon, both vocally, acting, and just movement. Our set is made of stairs, so I think, if anything, the music is the, the heart of it all. I think this is a really exciting piece of theater. It's unlike anything else that's out there, really. The music is great, the story is heartwarming and heart-wrenching at the same time, and it's funny, too, so it kind of has a little bit of everything. That's who I am. 